Good morning, everyone, and welcome to Fine Arts Friday. Every Friday morning, I will post a video on our Facebook page showing you some cool art activity that you could try at home. Um, I hope everyone is doing well out there. I really miss you guys. And I just wanna say thank you to everyone that has been um, sending me photos of their artwork. Uh, you guys are doing great things out there. So please keep that up. Keep creating art at home and sharing it with me. It makes my day. Um, so I will post these Fine Arts Friday videos on our Facebook page, but also on my website and the VES Art Instagram. Um, so I will show you right now how to access those things just in case you haven't been there yet. And then we'll jump into this week's activity. Okay, so to get to the art website, if you have not already been there, you'll go to the VES homepage, click on staff directory, scroll down till you find me, here I am, click on the globe, and then that will bring you right to my website. On the homepage, if you scroll down, this is where you can also access the Instagram account. Just click on any of the images and it will bring you to the homepage. And that's where you can see photos of artwork submitted from people the past few weeks and also photos of artwork that students have been working on all year long. Um, so please go check that out. Okay, so for this week's Fine Art Friday, uh, I'm sure that you guys, well, maybe you've seen online people reenacting famous works of art. So this week, I challenge you to try to do the same thing. I challenge you to find a piece of art that interests you um, and try to reenact it using things at your own house. Let me show you what I mean. If you go up to Art Resources, and you click on Fine Art Friday, it's gonna bring you to a presentation just showing you um, some examples of what people have been doing out there. So I'm just gonna slowly click through so you can kind of see what I'm talking about. Um, this person just used objects, rolls of toilet paper. Um, and a lot of people have been taking photos of themselves dressed up. So if you, you could go about it any way you would like to. using laundry, paper bags, plastic bags. Oh, even dirty dishes. Now if I can move me so you can see this one. Okay, so now I'm gonna show you the one that I reenacted. If you are a third grader, you might remember that we were studying the artist Henry Rousseau, um, and he's very famous for his jungle paintings, but he's also very well known for this painting called The Sleeping Gypsy. So in this painting, you see a woman asleep and you see a lion kind of creeping up behind her. I decided to reenact this painting because I thought maybe I can use my cat to uh, resemble the lion. Um, you'll <laughs> So what I did is I collected some materials that I thought were similar to the things in the painting. I've got my ukulele. I've got a bottle over here. Um, I just found a, a piece of wood outside and I made a moon out of white paper. So my cat was not really cooperating for that photo shoot. So that last image there was just, I, I took a gif of the lion from the Lion King and threw it into the background so that I can try to get that lion piece into my reenactment. Okay guys, so 
I hope that this movie got to you all in one piece. It was my first attempt to try to make a video like this. Um, and I really hope that you guys give this a try. Have fun with it. I can't wait to see what you come up with. Um, if you go back to my website and click on the art resources page, you'll see a whole list of digital resources and websites, museums that are offering virtual tours. So if you need to find some um, paintings to look at to get some inspiration for this Fine Arts Friday project, uh, feel free to go check out those websites. A lot of museums um, are offering up free access to their collections right now. All right, have a great weekend, and I will see you guys next week. Bye-bye.